with the lead as they bring the ball up. Green comes up. And it's the 24 of DeLuca moving around, takes over the lead. They're calling it back. Those idiots. Yellow comes out and they'll slow down and we'll get a double. And McGowan now. Bring it down off and turn to three and four. gets to feeling better after the transplant, he'll probably go back to it. Redman pushes the gallon up the race and service does do as good. As they go into turns one and two, it's going to be Dan McCallum jumping out into the lead and coming from that second place back there. Down the back straightaway. It is the double zero of Chris Sorensen and back to uh, Duluth and trying to make a move. Can't get it done there. And uh, Raceway pulls around, takes over that third position from Duluth and comes back at one and two. Up on that high side, there's door handle the door handle down the back straightaway. McGowan still on there with the lead. DeLuca again overdrive into turn one and two, but briefly can't take advantage of it. He gets blue. Gets it back up there, and DeLuca moves into that third spot. Jeff Briefly gets the 99 straight back around, but up right now we've got a race coming up there as Chris Sorensen has got Dan McGowan as they come off and turn four down to complete. Five laps, three to go. Sorensen again drives the bottom through turns one and two. Can't get it done there. Down the back straightaway into turns three and four. McGowan holds it dead center on that. Sorensen all over his rear bumper as DeLuca sits back in that third spot. Down off of turns three and four. Down the back straightaway. McGowan now has about a half a car when Sorensen pulls it in under braking. They bring them on the turns three and four. Whites out, one to go. Down into turns one and two. McCowan holds on to that half a car length. Opens it up to a full car length down the back straightaway. The rest of the field strung out. The race is for the lead. Sorensen 